Monday and I'm just getting ready to go to work. It is pretty gloomy here today in Vancouver. It's raining and usually I really hate the rain, but it's been sunny for like three weeks straight. So I don't mind a little bit of rain, but it is pretty gloomy outside. bring lunch because eating out in Vancouver is so expensive so I always pack something it's 9 30 right now and our first patient is scheduled to come at around 11 so I think I'm gonna head out the bus comes in 11 minutes so I can go and set up and do some work before they come probably custom built OCT system. We usually have clinical trials every week um, where we get patients with different types of ocular diseases and there are a few studies we're doing right now but we want to see if we image them with our system and then process the data in our way if we can see more information than um, what the commercialized OCT systems can tell us. There are definitely different types of biomedical engineering. There are wet labs where you work with a lot of solutions and samples and then I'm part of a dry lab so it's mostly computers processing um, and on top of that there's also clinical work that we do. We need this clinical data so that we can continue improving our systems and our algorithms and with every study you're going to need patients to sign certain consent forms. So we usually get the patient list um, for the day and then we hand it off to the front desk at the clinic and then when it is time they send the patient to us or we go down and get the patient and then once we finish with our system we send them back um, our work is purely research um, it's not really part of their clinical diagnosis but this information that we are able to get we share directly back with the clinicians and the clinicians will share it back with the patients i usually do a calibration with a model eye but i cannot find that model eye right now this is our software so when you click start it will start scanning and if there's an eye, you'll see something, but I cannot find the model eye right now, so... It is raining quite hard outside, um, but I just finished helping out with the imaging. We have two students helping us, so I'm going to head back to the lab and do some work while they finish for the day. Um, yeah, they've been doing well. I feel like the rest of my day will be quite uneventful because I'll just be at the computer all day. Um, but yeah, we'll see. Yeah. It's hard to get 10 good data. 
for his food. Yeah, for his food. <laughs> I just got home. It's been quite a long day. I mean, it's not too bad, but it was also raining really hard. So like the back of my pants were all wet because when you walk, you kick the water up. <sighs> okay, so I'll probably shower and then I will cook. I am making something new today, so I'm kind of excited. Um, yeah, see you soon. Okay, so today I'm trying a new recipe with chicken wings and Fermented bean curd. If you're Chinese, you probably know what this is. This is gonna be a little salty, so I'm only gonna use a little bit of marinade, just, just a little. I have the fermented bean curd chicken wings and some veggies and then um, I just have some leftover tofu, spicy tofu. So finishing that. Let's try the chicken wing. Whoa. I feel like every time I make some yummy food, I'm always super proud of myself. I don't actually have the energy to practice a lot, but there's this part that I've been drilling, so I thought it would be a good idea to at least review some of it. Mm -hmm. 